What's up everybody, it's your boy Ragdoll, back with another episode of the Bug Type Only Challenge and Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Last episode, we got our 7 gym badge, we um, saved all of the Pixie Fairy Pokemon of their respective lakes. Um, we beat Cyrus, Team Galactic boss, and now we have to climb Mount Coronet to uh, beat him once and for all. And um, like I said in the last episode, we're going to Throat Chop a Dialga. Yeah, that's some pretty good stuff right there. I'm looking forward to it. I really want to Throat Chop a Dialga. I'm going to kill it. I'm not even going to catch it. I just want to beat it. And this, this screams hidden item. And it wasn't one. I was bamboozled. Yeah, we're gonna skip that galactic battle. Um, okay. Yep, we're gonna rock smash that. Skip him. I wonder what's over here to the point where... Okay, nothing. Yo, hold on, wait. I could have did that this entire time and skipped all of that? Wow. I didn't know that. But yeah, we're gonna use this repel again. Yo, get out the way. Okay, maybe that wasn't the right way. But if it wasn't, why is Team Galactic over here? Okay. Alright. Hold on, wait, let me, let me save my progress. <laughs> let me be safe real quick. Galactic grunts, this is the right way. Night Slash Skadoosh. All right, Cricket Tune, you gotta you gotta start killing those. Never mind. Never mind. You just set me up with Fell Stinger. I see what you did, buddy. And watch him have a gold bat. When you see that attack boost, you just can't help but to just, oh, right in your pants. <laughs> oh. Nothing like justice being served. I said, you can't do anything alone, yet I'm doing this all alone. I gotta see something real quick. So, the super effective Night Slash doesn't one-hit KO. Like, I, I gotta hit it twice. 
So, yep. I should have just been using this move twice. Oh, never mind. Just changed everything. But let me use it again anyway. I might get a critical hit. No, no, I didn't. And of course, I get hit with Confuse Ray. I'm gonna get the first turn snap. You gotta, you gotta speak things into existence. Here it is. Okay, all right. And, and I hit myself. Good job, Beethoven. Gosh, I hate confusion. There we go. All right. I still hate confusion, but at least I snapped out. And I get my attack boost. Nice. Got it just in time. I should be able to kill this gold bat in one hit. I gotta take Krikatuno out from the front. Cause I think, I think this is the part where I throw Chopper Dialga. <laughs> um, should I worry about who or not? Nah, I'm not gonna worry about it. Cause um, I really do think that uh. Oh, I tried to go on the outside. I really don't think I'll be using Cricket Tune anymore this um this episode. Just because it's, its level is too high. everything else wow get your paws off me stupid glamia glamia looks so judgmental <laughs> but not least a Bronzor. Okay. All right. And there we go. All right, here's the grand finale right here. I got to save it. Even though I just did it five minutes ago. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on, guys. Y'all really think y'all can beat me? Like, for real. Alright, Meredith. Let's show them what you got. Alright, but we're definitely gonna break, break that stunky. And we're gonna quiver dance. Awesome, he used protect for nothing. Joke's on you, buddy. Oh god, I'm so tired of aftermath. a boost I mean which move is stronger oh they both they both do 60 
Um, don't want to miss. And we'll just hit that Glammy out with the flash cannon. Awesome. Hair Cross is uh, taking names, man. I should have nicknamed my Hair Cross Death Note. <laughs> Actually, that's a pretty cool name. And that was adorable. That was some adorable damage. Now look at you. Dead and shit. Mind your business, Glamio. That would never have happened if you would have just stayed in your Pokeball, man. Okay, we're gonna finish this off with a area lace and side beam combo. Okay, so I'm about to try something really stupid. I think I'm about to fight those galactic grunts. And if I am, if I am, I would like to lead off with. Actually, no, let me let me keep hair across in the front. Let me hit look. Look at that stance. He means business. Wow, Dialga. Yo, Cyrus is just going too far, man. Wow. He said, create a new world. All right. I'm gonna keep my team as is. Hair across the stand in the front. Oh, he said, "Look at Dick Butt coming through." All right, Dick Butt, don't don't embarrass me, man. And they both got Bronzor. And Dick Butt has Munchalax. Alright, man. I'm just getting my throat chop ready because I'm going to throw chop a Dialga. You'll see. <laughs> Alright, look at that reflect. That did no damage. Alright, dick butt. You're getting critical hits and stuff. Yeah, but let me get rid of that reflect for you. The next bite. The next bite should, you know, KO. Okay. I thought that confused her. It was coming toward me, man. I was about to get upset. I'm tired of getting confused. Of course he breaks through confusion. I mean like, I don't want to sound like a hater, but he shook off that confusion pretty easy. Okay. Now here's a real debacle. Do I go for the Perugly, knowing that it has Aerial Ace? 
Or do I go for the gold bat that also has flying moves? We go for the gold bat. Okay, LeBron. Hayes. No one boosted their stats. So that kind of sucks. Paralyze it. Paralyze it. Much like you're useless. <laughs> I was hoping he was going to hit the Munchlax, but it's okay. Not the end of the world. Not while I'm around, it's not the end. Okay. Okay. Um... I think Melville would be very safe. I'm gonna use Quiver Dance. I'm gonna use Quiver Dance twice. Hitting the gold bat. Hold on, wait. Oh no, she has the skunk tank with flamethrower. Oh man, this this sucks. I gotta go for a flash cannon. Yeah, I, I just gotta hit this thing. Please hit the munch lags. Okay, you freaking hater. <laughs> I tried. It's okay. I mean, taking out Perugly is, you know, important too. But gee dang it. Alrighty. Um. I mean, I got bulldogs, man. Oh shit, that's right, she has a gold bat. <laughs> well, my mistake. But that don't mean I can't hit this bulldoze. Hit the munchlax, man. And of course I get burned. Jeez. Okay, it's not the end of the world though. It's not. I can't believe I got burned. But at the same time too, I shouldn't be surprised either. All right, um. I mean, okay. I think. See, I shouldn't trust going for a critical hit. I'm just gonna go straight away for a bug buzz. I mean, that did decent damage. Now you hit the freaking much lags. Dang, got a critical hit and the burn. That's tough. And you finally get the paralyzed. That's all we were asking for, much lags, buddy. I'm gonna use Bug Buzz again on that skunk tank. Oh man. But on the bright side, 
I should uh, be able to use Air Cutter. Oh man, that Belch would have did a lot of damage. Oh man. Dickbutt has an Infernape. And that's why I went for Air Cutter. So sick of the extra. You should have started off with Infinite, buddy. Because I took all those hits for basically nothing. I said it's my world. It's my new world. It's beautiful. Uh oh. The pixies came. Broke the red chain, man. Cyrus is salty about that. Look at Mesprit. I like, hey, yo, son, you good people, son. But I'm finna lickety split up out of here, boy. That's a Dialga right there. <laughs> like you did this <laughs> all right Cyrus is pissed off man and in the span of 30 minutes he caught he caught another Pokemon so there we go all right this Honch Crow is gonna be a problem hopefully not a big problem be able to live that right <laughs> no no I don't <laughs> but that's why though he, he got a critical hit now I'm gonna go for a brick break okay okay Meredith wants to learn a flail too bad, Meredith. He's definitely about to kill me now. Tailwind? Okay, that's interesting. How come he doesn't miss his his air cutters? But I miss mine. Beautiful, I miss so many air cutters. But this is what I'm gonna do. This is the perfect time for me to use Quiver Dance. Um. 
use it twice. Awesome, he doesn't get the critical hit just yet. I hope this side beam kills. Man, he wasn't supposed to be faster. I hit him with a rock tune and I used quiver dance twice. Unless Marmadam is really just that slow. Oh man, U-turn. He's gonna U-turn into that stupid fucking Weavile. Oh, Gyarados. Okay, I'm not worried about Gyarados. But at the same time, I have no moves to hit this Gyarados. Um... I shouldn't be surprised about that. Yeah, here comes the toxic. Toxic finish shot combo. And I don't have to worry about flinching. Okay, I was worried about missing the toxic, not gonna lie. Out of all Pokemon for this guy to have, he has a freaking Gyarados. Alright, Dustox, I'm gonna need you to dodge it. Okay, okay. You don't dodge, but... Okay. You're gonna dodge that next attack, though. Right? Right, buddy? Oh my goodness, this guy's getting real competitive with me, man. Alright, he has a choice. He's either gonna knock me out, or go for the Tailwind. A full restore- Cyrus! You son of a- Oh, jeez! You freaking cheater. Okay, all right. I get the I get the drop. Give me another one. Survive. Ah, that's what you get using items. Freaking nerd. Crit him. Okay. All right, now he uses tailwind. Come on. Ha! Happened twice. Alright. Now that... That's a happy miscalculation right there. I'm thankful for it. Here's the Weavile though. This is uh, his ace. Okay. No surprise, he finally took it out. Um. <laughs> I mean. I love making bad decisions, man. egg scissor and then if he survives I'm gonna use a uh, bell stinger oh man he did exactly half damage okay well this is still good to knock him out no harm no foul there You're about to lose, buddy. You're gonna lose to a critical hit, Night Slash. 
Okay, so he didn't lose to a critical hit night slash. He's gonna lose to poison damage. And man, another, another. You know what? I don't know if I can call that like, you know, a cheat or an exploit or whatever you want to call it. But those one HP survival hits have definitely been saving me this run. I don't regret it. I don't feel bad about it. But man, it's been saving me. And look at these two guys. Like, come on now. I mean... Can y'all heal your boy up though? Nope, nobody wanted to heal me. But everybody want me to stop Dialga. Ain't that something? But I'm I'm definitely gonna uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna kill this Dialga and I'm gonna do it with a throat chop. <laughs> Cause then he won't be able to use Roar of Time and do a whole bunch of damage. I'm literally about to toy with this thing. Alright, Diaga. What's your beef, buddy? I wonder, does this game force you to uh, catch it? Now, I don't know why like the battlefield just got all distorted. I mean, it looks pretty cool, but they didn't have to do all that. Throw chop. Ancient power? And he gets the boost right away. He gets an Omni boost. I'm telling you, if I was ought to tell people my Pokemon stories, they would not believe me. I mean, I throw chopped it. But does that stop him from using Roar of Time? Jesus! Probably should have used Rock Tomb. Gosh. Okay. I mean, at least he didn't use Roar of Time. That definitely would have killed me. But all right. Let's uh. Let me see. What can we do from here? I could bulldoze him. However, this thing is doing a lot of damage to me. He has a plus one. And everything. I think, I think infestation is the way to go. Okay. I mean, damn. That did a lot of damage. <laughs> See, yeah. Uh, I hope he uses a uh, slash. Okay. All right, all right. I really need him to do something stupid, like, you know, miss. That'll be great if he could miss. I mean, from this damage, uh, I, I died. <laughs> That's okay though. That's okay. You know what? I'm gonna send out our starter, our best friend right here. I think a critical hit should be able to... Wow, I forgot. Gosh! Okay, I was talking all that shit about this Dialga, but it's, uh, it's kind of scaring me a little bit. I gotta bulldoze this thing, man. Of course, another ancient power. Damn. I mean, I'm not surprised. 
truthfully, I'm not. But at the same time, miss. <laughs> miss. Skillfully dodge. Give me something. Fucking game. Okay. Alright, Melville. Melville is ready to miss a bug buzz for me. <laughs> All right, we took him down. Scram, skedaddle. I don't have to catch it, do I? No, okay. Let's all go home. I mean, what y'all? Um, can I just fly from here? That'd be really nice. And of course I can't. Let me see if I can escape rope out of here. And of course I can't. All right. Let me see if I can use it now. I swear if it brings, uh, brings me back to the pillar. Okay. Now that we can deal with. All right. And now we gotta head over to Sunny Shore. Okay. But first, let's go to Twin Leaf. I'm only going to Twin Leaf just to heal up. Because why not? Alright, alright. But, um... I'm gonna make this one, this episode, a short one. Um, we took down Team Galactic for good. We fought Diaga. I was able to throat chop it. That's really all I wanted to do was just throat chop that Diaga. It's too bad Heracross, you know, went down so so fast. But we throat chopped it. That's all we wanted. We wanted to throat chop it. I wish it. I wish I could have throat chopped it, and then it wanted to use Roar of Time. But you know. It's okay. We still throw chopped it. But um, that's going to wrap it up for this episode. In the next episode, we're going to be heading to Sunny Shore City, getting our 8th gym badge, and we're going to be beefing up our team to get ready for the, the Pokemon League. And um, that's what we've been waiting for this whole time. We've been waiting on the final showdown, the Elite Four. Um, with my current team, with my current team, do I think I can make it? I might just use Meredith and uh, Bag Lady. I might use them both at the same time, being the fact that for some odd reason, I have still not found a female Combi. Combi is one of the most common Pokemon on the, on the honey trees. So to not find one, that's crazy. But um, again, that's going to wrap it up for this episode. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.